Yamna Al-Arashi is a photographer, filmmaker and writer. Her aesthetic hopes to shift the conversation around women's rights and human rights injustices. Much of her work spotlights the hijab as empowerment, as she notes that people often disregard Muslim women as being incapable of power or identity simply because they wear hijab. Her work explores the joining of nature, the female form and history. Al Rashi gives life to extraordinary imagery and enlightened conversation. Tatiana Fazlalizadeh is a Brooklyn-based multimedia artist, well known for her site-specific murals and best known for her high acclaimed art exhibition, Stop Telling Women to Smile. Her work plays homage to identity intersections and how her identity plays out in the mundane. Her work exists to speak for the misspoken and challenges microaggressions in the most insightful way. You may have seen her work in Spike Lee's Netflix series, She's Gotta Have It. Princess Faroniza Zaid was a fundamental artist within the Turkish avant-garde scene in the 1940s. Zaid was a pioneer being the first woman to go to art school in Istanbul. Her large abstract paintings and kaleidoscopic patterns are a union of Islamic, Byzantine, Arab and Persian influences with European approaches to abstraction, making quite radical work for a princess. Zaid reimagined space with her large wall-sized creations. Edja Tushaw is a London-based multidisciplinary artist working primarily in the medium of photography. Her work has a crossover between editorial, fine art and the commercial world. Some of her projects explored visuals of what it means, feels like and to look like to be a black British Muslim woman. Her emotive work delves into the confines she faces as a Fulani woman with religious expectations. Yemeni photographer Bushra Amatavakal's work focuses on the perceptions of Muslims and Arabs, with the primary look on gender and the representation of the Muslim woman. Her photojournalism has been viewed in numerous political, cultural, council and commercial advertising. Her work stands as a comment upon the feeling of being objectified. She questions why Muslim women need to be at the centre of visual discussion. Iranian visual artist Shirin Neshat is primarily known for her work in film, video and photography. Her stunning work explores her contrasts of her upbringing, being from a religious background but not necessarily living religiously. As a self-professed storyteller, she inquires the gaze on the Muslim woman and she examines her sense of displacement in the US, the tale of being in the epicenter of two realms. Lala Asadi is a Moroccan-born visual artist. In her work, she returns to her Moroccan girlhood with retrospect as an adult woman. She visually explores the feeling of being caught somewhere between the past and the present. Her aesthetic makes for striking imagery and makes the viewer question the reality of her creations. With her imagery, she challenges voyeurism, orientalism and objectification. Painter and designer Sadiqa Juma creates Islamic guided work with sequential layers of vivid colour and repetitive patterns. Her contemporary work reflects the ancient illuminated Qurans. Her highlighted work presents the journey to Hajj, the emotional, taxing and liberating voyage. Her work is visually captivating and beautiful, an artist to currently follow. Zaha Mohammed Hadid was an Iraqi British architect and designer. Her spectacular designs are imaginative, bold and innovative, especially for the times. Those works include the high-speed train station in Naples, the Guangzhou Opera House, Galaxy Soho in Beijing, China and so on. Fluidity and movement were prominent in her work as she was described by The Guardian as the Queen of Curve. She has left behind an unshakable legacy for women in architecture. Shadi Gardirian is an Iranian contemporary photographer. Her work is influenced by her experiences as a Muslim woman living in contemporary Iran. She often places monotonous objects amongst imagery of women to critically comment on the imbalanced forces of the modern world and Iranian living. Her art is laced with satire and of course truth as she depicts the preconceptions of the role of the woman in both the Middle East and the West.